Anekon Udofia is hard at work painting the portrait of a local musician. Um, it might be three to four layers of different colors. The brush is an ordinary one with rough bristles, the kind you use to paint fences. But the paint is not the kind normally used to create pictures. It's exterior uh, outdoor paint. For this wall, it would be about 30 to 50 cans. 16 different portraits fit on a wall that is a few meters long. The faces are familiar. A former mayor of Washington, along with famous politicians, entertainers, and athletes. So right here we have Prince. Muhammad Ali, Barack Obama, I've put her, uh, him together as a couple, him and his wife. To capture the best look, Anakon, along with his art director, looked at more than 100 photos of each character. Try to make sure that you're doing things that they would agree with, or that the people who love and care about them would agree with. The narrative included people who really aren't involved in any controversy. It started as a few sketches, then an outline of black paint right on the wall. The final product, a large-scale mural, the American term used to describe massive wall paintings. Anekon says that one color is not enough for each face. Shades and tones are necessary to create a lifelike image. You have to step back. <laughs> step back, yes. Yeah. And see how it's working. If I work like that, I would finish in two years. Each year, the Washington, D.C. government allocates about $100,000 for murals like these. The idea is to fight unlawful graffiti, but it turns out that graffiti lovers respect the murals. So it was saving the property owners money, it was saving the city money, so it was a big cost savings. A lot of times people look at a mural and they might ask how much it would cost, but what they don't realize is how much it costs for us to keep coming out, sometimes every month, to paint over the same property. The program has existed for 10 years and aims to engage local youth by teaching them professional art techniques. So far, 54 murals have been painted on different buildings across the city. Artistic committees or local residents usually choose the themes. Each mural tells its own story, beautifies its neighborhood, and deters illegal graffiti. For Lesia Bakalet, Sergei Sokolov, I'm Joy Wagner, VOA News, Washington.